This is the last big tag for the last page of my um, mini. And I kind of wanted to show you some of the techniques I used there. This is the basic page that I used. These are um, some of the pictures, two of the pictures that I'm going to actually put on the tag. I always, always mount my pictures on a, a sheet of, of plain cardstock. And I always take my ticket punch and I always take my ticket corner punch and I punch the corners. I'm going to take my ATC gun and I'm going to run my adhesive on that so I can get that affixed to this particular there we go now these are going to sit on this page like this I've already taken my vintage photo and I have distressed the edges of this uh, these are going to sit on this like this I uh, did a, uh, a tutorial on how I made this flower I kind of wanted to show you some of the differences this flower this particular leaf has glimmer mist homemade glimmer mist only on it this leaf these these flowers are all done using Velma's technique. Uh, this has glimmer mist and it's Velma's technique with the um, embossing powder. Uh, these flowers are Velma's technique with embossing powder and um, glimmer mist. These flowers are Velma's technique with um, shimmers paint and no glimmer mist and uh, embossing powder and again this is Velma's technique this is another flower using Velma's technique and this is glimmer mist and homemade shimmers paint uh, this is yet another one using Velma's technique um, I didn't use uh, anything on the back of this flower the back flower but this one is Velma the front flower is Velma's technique I just wanted you to see how those go together and this again is Velma's technique. This this leaf is Velma's technique, and this leaf is the um, you can see the difference. This leaf leaf is just the homemade shimmers, and this is Velma's technique. So you can kind of see the difference there. So this flower is going to be going on the corner like this. These are going to be on this page like this and I will use my ATC gun to place those and on the back I'm going to put this piece of mounting cardstock uh, I want to, for whoever receives this to be able to interchange this and so I've made these little corners and this is where I use my envelopes that uh, my business return envelopes and I take my vintage photo and I go on and I uh, distress this corner of this envelope. I just cut straight across whatever size I want. And this is the cardstock that I'm going to put on top of it. And then I've torn that cardstock. And then I'm going to distress the edges of that cardstock. And then I take my glue and I glue this cardstock this envelope corner when you know when you're doing a video that your glue jams up on you so I take this glue and I put the designer paper on that. I just want to be sure that that corner is covered so you can see how I cover the corner and I just take a, a piece of um, scrap paper just to be sure that that uh, is still open. Ok, 
say, and then when that is, then I take the cardstock that I'm going to be using for the mounting piece, and I'm going to put these corners on that piece, and then I'm going to lay it on my tag, so that tells me where it's going to fit. And I come in then, and I put the glue on the back of the envelope corners. For a long time I didn't know how to get my corners so that my the pieces that were um, going to be moving in and out would fit. And then I lay that on my tag, and I am sure that that is sure that that's down and then I have those corners in just the right place and I'll be able to move this piece out and I want to mount my photo and those corners will be in the right place and then of course these will be placed on the front here and this flower will be, will be placed there and that'll be my tag for the last page. Thank you for watching. I hope all these little tips helped. I know that sometimes they've helped me. So um, I'll be showing you my box next. I'm going to show you a video of the box before I um, alter it. And then I will show you the finished product. Thank you for watching. Oh, I am going to do a tutorial on the, the wire and bead binding. Thank you for watching. Bye now.